It's the number six Gamecocks versus the number five Bulldogs with ESPN College Game Day in town. Gamecocks looking to go to 6-0, and and they get off to a good start and a fast start as Connor Shaw hits the mirror bird 42 yards down the field. Bird wrestles the ball away from the Georgia defender, and that is going to set up a Connor Shaw-Bruce Ellington connection that goes for 20 yards in the back of the end zone. Carolina up 7 to nothing after just two and a half minutes. On the next Georgia drive, Kelsey Quarles bats the ball, and Devontae Holloman dives, grabs it, Gamecock football, and that is going to set up a Connor Shaw to Buster Anderson 14-yard fade route, touchdown, add seven points. That's South Carolina up now 14 to nothing. And then on the next drive, the defense forces a three and out, and Georgia makes the mistake of punting to Ace Sanders. He's going to take it back, use his ninja moves, use the force. He goes back 70 yards all the way to the end zone. Couldn't make it quite there in the Missouri game. He does make it this time. Gamecocks up 21 to nothing in the first quarter. Later in the third quarter, Connor Shaw's going to hook up with the big man downfield, D.L. Moore. That's good for 62 yards down to the one-yard line. It's going to set up the Marcus Lattimore show. He's going to punch it in from there. And that's going to make the score. Carolina up four touchdowns at 28 to nothing. In the fourth quarter, the Gamecocks are able to do something they haven't been able to do all year. They have a long drive that eats up eight minutes and 43 seconds off the clock, and they capitalize on that Connor Shaw touchdown. Gamecocks up 35 to nothing. Defense held on for 58 and a half minutes, but they can't hold on the whole game. Ken Malcolm gets down inside the five yard line. He punches it in from there. Final score, South Carolina 35, Georgia 7. Hunter Banks, Capital City Sports.